So this being our first time at Disney World, we totally went the wrong way. We were going over the bridge and we were heading to the boardwalk, but now we're, Lindsay got us on the right track and we're headed to the International Gateway in Epcot and get another super looking forward to having a blast today here. We're newbies. I know. What's the first thing you guys want to do? Go to get Eat? breakfast. Please. I'm hungry. I'm hungry too. I, I think we're going to head to France to yeah. check out Layal. I think it's called Layal Patisserie. Wow. It's like a bakery and it's supposed to be, when, that's one thing that we are, I am a sucker for is just incredibly yummy Disney baked goods. Oh. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a sucker for any kind of baked good, but yeah, Disney makes everything the best. All of our first times here. So we are excited to see something stuff that's new. So we can't wait. Yeah, here we are. All right, here we go. We're gonna check out Leal Boulangerie Patasserie. He looks like he's on a, he's on a oh, There's Remy, that's awesome. Let's see, they have baguettes. Oh, look at that cute stuff here. The smell. If we didn't have our masks on, it would be like, oh my gosh. Baguette, fresh warm baguette. So we are in Morocco Pavilion. Wow, this is beautiful. So much detail here. This is a cool looking place here. It's called the Fez House. Check this out. What do we got here? Caramel butter bar. Oh boy, that looks really good. Mm. Butter. Oh wow. Mmm. Wow. That's really good. <gasps> Look at this. Gingerbread. Look at the caramel buttercream. Look at the cookie. Look at the sandwich. caramel. Uh, 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 uh. You want the first bite? Mine. Mine. Oh. Big bite. Big bite. Big bite. Mmm. That's caramel the whole thing. Mmm. Oh, I like this one better than the butter. Yeah? Mmm. Mmm. Wow. Good. That's good. Okay. It's caramel the whole thing. Give me the butter. I'm probably gonna go this one. Okay. We went to caramel cuche. These are really good. I love this gingerbread cookie one. Mm -hmm. Caramel butter bar is really good. We also got caramel corn. Lindsay's gonna try that. That they make fresh every day. Lindsay's gonna try it. Let us know how it is. And Mickey, Mickey goldfish. Yeah, Alyssa's eating goldfish. <laughs> Mickey goldfish, though. From Target. Can I have that? I'd like it better if it was warm, but it's really good. 
So we are in Norway, here at Epcot, and we have eaten our way through part of Epcot already. We got some food at France. Oh yeah. That well, was amazing. Breakfast slash, breakfast slash lunch. lunch. Actually, we're just kind of snacking for lunch and breakfast, I guess. So. We're going to La Cellier tonight for dinner, so we're excited about that, but we're also trying to like eat just a little bit throughout the day. So. Doing a lot of sharing. Yeah, we're trying to learn how to do that. <laughs> yeah. We're about to get on our first ride of the day at Frozen Ever After. So we are here in the Mexico Pavilion, and we just got some done some, some tacos and empanadas. Alyssa, what did you get? It's like spicy crawfish. Yeah, it's spicy crawfish flavor. You want to try these? Yeah. You're brave. They smell weird. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, they smell weird. How do they taste? Not bad. Not bad. Good. Yeah. Can I try one. Mm. Oh, I'm getting a little fish flavor in there. <laughs> Not bad. I'm getting a little fish flavor. Lindsay's gonna try one now. This is a big day. Yeah. Wow. Lindsay trying something out of the norm. She's actually been doing a pretty good job with that. She has been doing a good job. Very proud of you. Isn't it weird? No, weird. <laughs> I didn't think she'd like it. There you go. Good job trying it. I don't want it. Now this is a bit fishy. A little fishy. Well, oh, interesting snack. It's one of the cool things about Epcot is that there's all sorts of different unique snacks from around the world here. They had a barbecued squid one. I don't know if I'd want to try it. What about one cucumber by that? Well, we're going to keep looking for uh, new things to eat, new things to try, and new rides that we haven't gone on before here at Epcot. Our first day. Looking forward to more. Festival of the Arts hasn't started yet. It's about to in a few days, but the chalk art artists are already busy at work. That is really cool. They're doing such an amazing job. And this is Alyssa in her element. She loves this stuff. Alyssa, what'd you love seeing downstairs? Uh, eels. Eels and what else? Seahorses. Seahorses? Those are cool. Look at these big fish. I think that's an eagle, right? Oh my gosh, that is giant. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's so cute. Hi, little guy. 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 Hey guys, we are home now. It's been some time since we got back from our trip to hey. Disney World. What? 
We're home. Why do we have to wear a mask? Can oh, yeah. Take them off now? Yes. Okay. Please. Yeah. Woo! That's better. You just saw the, the kind of the vibe of La Cellier where we kind of ended our night because we didn't end the vlog. We are in such a food coma after such a fun, long day at Disney Eating Around World Showcase, finishing it off at La Cellier. We had a great time. We're going to tell you about La Cellier, but first I did want to tell you a little bit more about Leal. Leal. Yeah. Leal, yeah. So that is where we started the day. You saw just a little bit of video from there. And I just, I want to talk more about it just because it ended up being one of my very favorite meals of our entire trip. Yeah. So I just remember that was our first morning in Disney World going to Epcot. And I was like, okay, you know, let's get some food. Let's get a bagel or something. And Chris was like, well, no, let's, let's go to France. Oh, okay. I honestly had no idea what we were doing. I, I, don't I, I do all the planning and prepping and list making. I show up. And she shows up. And I'm hungry. So I wanted, I'm like, just let's get a bagel. No. Well, I, I hate the idea of going somewhere and not knowing what our best options are. I'm so thankful he does that because we <laughs> went to lay all and you saw kind of just what some of the options were to order there. But we, I had one of the very best things I ate the whole time, which was a, a like a croissant breakfast sandwich with Gruyere cheese and bacon. And I think we shared it. It was amazing. So delicious. Yeah. And then also a, um, a, a quiche that was just yeah. the texture and the flavors were so delicious. And the, and then the girls had some different things, but one of the things they had was just a baguette, just yeah. a plain old baguette, but they would not stop talking about that baguette no, for days. We went back a few times to get more baguettes. Yeah. They love those baguettes yeah, and the rest, good. little raspberry jam that came with it. So good. Uh, so go to lay all so delicious. Yep. You will not be disappointed. Yeah. We ate all around world showcase. We went on rides. Such a fun, relaxing day because Epcot is, to me, probably one of the more relaxing parks. It was fun to end our day at La Cellier. Uh, we started the meal off with um, this amazing Canadian beer cheese soup. Canadian uh, can cheddar cheese cheddar, soup. Yeah, Canadian cheddar and cheese soup. And it was so good. Really rich, really flavorful, yeah. so tasty. And then they had poutine offerings. And poutine is basically fries with gravy and cheese and yummy sauce. This one, I think, was the signature poutine. At La Cellier, it had like a red wine sauce with truffle. It was delicious. It was so I mean, good. I don't like gravy. It's not like, you know, Thanksgiving gravy. It's 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 a delicious creamy sauce that they put on top of French fries. So yeah. it was good. We shared both of those. Yep. And then we also shared the main course because we looked ahead of time at the menu and we saw these delicious things. That's saw the prices. Yeah. So we wanted to try a lot. And I think the entree we got was the um, filet. Yeah. And it was so good. It was like 60 bucks. Yeah. So we so shared. we shared because that's how you do Disney economically. If that's if, a thing. If that's a thing. It's not. <laughs> but. but we loved it. It had this really amazing mushroom risotto with it. Some mm -hmm. like amazing truffle butter over it. It was so good. It's cooked perfectly. And with we like to share. I mean, I've kind of convinced you and converted you over the years to be able to share with me. Yep, she we can, has. We can try more things that, that way and then true. not leave feeling super stuffed. And then we got these, they, they had these enhancements. Mm -hmm. Fancy. Uh, at La Cellier. And one of them was Brussels sprouts, like brown sugar, maple, Brussels sprouts. I don't know. They it was were so delicious. good. They were like candy. Yeah. I think if vegetable can be a candy, that's it. I think I asked how they made them so good. And I'm pretty sure she told me they were deep fried. So it probably in butter, I'm sure. And the girls, they each got a steak. They loved it. And the kids menus are great because they're much cheaper than an adult menu. And they get an option of a, like they got steak. Um, they can get a vegetable with it. And they also can choose a dessert and all in one price. It's great. We got dessert, warm pecan, brown butter oh, yeah. tart. That was good. Mm -hmm. And you'll see a video of it right now. It was so good. And uh, I got the maple creme brulee. And that was very good too. I love creme brulee. Who doesn't love custard covered by a hard shell of sugar you have to crack through with a spoon just to get to it? It's amazing. Honestly, I think the, the brown butter tart was better. We loved our time at Epcot. Uh, we loved eating through Epcot and World Showcase, and we had such an amazing first day at Disney World. Thanks for watching. Thanks for uh, subscribing. If you have, if you haven't, what are you waiting for? Subscribe. We'd love to have you uh, just share something in comments. If you've been to Disney World before, if you've been to La Cellier, or if you're planning a trip to go there, leave a question down in the comments or just say hi and share your experience uh, at Epcot or at La Cellier that you've, that you've had in the past. Make sure you, uh, if you subscribe, hit the notification bell to be notified every time we upload a new video. But thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon. Bye. Bye.